What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Milton coming back with another review. And today, <clears throat> today we're gonna do the uh, Warzik Damage Screw Extractor Set. Now, this is a 22-piece set that's basically utilized to extract screws once they are stripped. Quite frankly, I've done this countless times. So, what I'm gonna do for you today is do a live demonstration on what to do and how to use it. Is it is it pretty much durable? Is it is it trustworthy? I can tell you right now. I believe so. So, I'm gonna get that live that live demo so you can see this in its entirety from the strip portion to the extraction portion, uh, and I'll show you how useful this product is. So, without further ado, we're gonna make this fast. Let's get to the video so I can show you exactly how to extract that screw. All right, you two. Basically, just continuing on. This is basically what it comes in. It is the Work You kit set. It's a 22 piece extraction remover tool uh, and it's used for pretty much what when your, your screws are pretty much stripped you screw screwing to something you use a drill gun you're using too much force and the sh screw basically strips I mean it happens more times than <laughs> you can imagine now I'm not a handy guy but I do like the way that this is all set up because it does have two sides to this you're gonna have your furnishing pieces all right, so this is going to be the piece where once the screw is stripped, you're going to use this to basically dig inside the screw to kind of make a nice hole. And then you're going to use the extraction side, which is these this portion, these type of pieces, to remove the screw itself. Now, I'm not a handy guy, as I said before. So what you do know, and that's what I do know, is that you need a drill gun to do all of this. Because what the pieces that's also included in this kit, which I think is pretty cool, um, you're going to use these pieces to basically you know insert in your drill gun of course make sure you tighten this so it's in there secure tight because you put too much pressure on it you know if it's not in there tightly sometimes it'll wiggle get loose and that that, that all depends on strength so let me just uh take this out for a second uh and what i'm going to do is try to do a live demo now again i'm not a professional it may or may not work uh, i want to see what happens when i strip this screw into here and see if it's possible for me to remove this. So let's just start right now. Counterclockwise, here we go. Now, I don't imagine anybody ever doing that to a screw or screwing anything like that <laughs> in the form, but the whole point is that I want to purposely strip it. So I'm kind of doing that at an angle. I think I've done enough damage. Uh, and just for you, for those that are looking, you just want to make sure I did it correctly. Um, may or may not have, but just so you can see that, yes, it is stripped and it's stripped badly. So, as I said, you want to take the furnishing side. Uh, and typically, something like this, it has different sizes. You want to make sure that you can get something in there, at least tight enough, to take it out. So I'm gonna use a furnishing side to furnish it. With my drill gun, furnishing side. Uh, from what I understand, and from what I've read, that you don't wanna do it too hard. Uh, just kind of groove your way in. So you wanna tighten it. the furnishing is done we are now going to use the extraction portion and I think this is the one that is equivalent to it so let me just put this in here and if you notice they're all lined up so once you see the furnishing side it's usually lined up to the correct ex extraction side so you want to make sure I took this from here so that means that I need the extraction which is this size right here again they make it easy for you so you know people like me again who are not handy people so let's see if we can tighten this up make sure that's in here and lefty loosey Actually coming out, but the problem is, I made the mistake of 
putting too much pressure on it. Uh, there we go. This is actually pretty good because quite honestly, it is coming out like they said it is. I made the mistake of putting too much pressure on it. But it should come out. Let me just see something. Else. thing you can do actually I don't know, thinking about it is if you do go a size higher which is possible it should have enough grip to pull it all the way out which what, what I mean by that is that since I had this size uh, what happens if I go a size up will that also pull it out so we're gonna find that out okay now let's try it Uh, pretty good and pretty nerve-wracking because again not a handyman but just wanted to show you that live quick demo so your boy Milknificent and this video was brought to you by Workyug I think it's a cool set for anybody that is a handyman this might be useful to you and hopefully this video is helpful to you in determining whether you wanted to purchase this product or not I will leave the Amazon link down to this product on my YouTube page on the details Feel free to subscribe and I hope that you have a wonderful day.